Hey Sips Loud fam, welcome back to the channel. So it is rumored that Nicki Minaj and her husband, Kenneth Petty, are over. Like they both called it quits, okay? And these are rumors, okay? Y'all don't owe me to it because I've been hearing things, I've been seeing things. And Nicki Minaj did made a rant on stage at her Pink Friday tour in Atlanta. Then again, it could be people from in the past, like Safari, Meek Mill, or whoever. Because recently, Kanye West came out to say, you know, he literally went to Safari, not knowing that Safari and Nicki were a couple. He basically asked Safari if he thought that Nicki would be up for a three, for a trio with uh, him and Amber. So Kanye's like, Nicki, I want you, me, and Amber to do a trio. But it never happened. He never went to Nikki directly. And Safari, you know, was basically trolling the whole situation on Instagram because, you know, I feel like he is low key still obsessed with Nicki Minaj. Other people like the Cardi B fan pages were like, you know, Nikki and Kenneth Petty are over. Everyone knew this, you know, relationship with Nikki and Ken wouldn't work. She was just being with this man for attention. She doesn't really care about him. But why would she have a baby with him? Why would she have a baby with someone who she was not sure about? You know, I think, you know, probably Cardi B fans, they just really dislike Nicki Minaj. So, of course, when they hear whatever she says, they're going to run with it with some negativity to say, you know, Kenneth Petty and Nicki are over. But it could be because, like, you know, given the circumstances of his past, and Nicki Minaj being dragged and bullied on the internet about him and what he had done, probably she feels some type of way or insecure in the marriage. Like, you know, you're screwing with my career, so it's time to let you go. But I hope these rumors are not true because regardless of what people are saying about Nicki Minaj's husband, like that was his past, not that I'm saying I endorse what he had done, I would never endorse what he had done, but you know, the past is the past. And I felt like he paid his dues, though I'm still hurting for the victim, of course, because, you know, she would have to live with that. And that is something that I would want her to heal from because who can easily bounce back from being assaulted or raped? You know, that that's something very sensitive, but I can't blame Nikki if she were to move on. I'm not going to say Nikki had a uh, great exes because Safari and Meek Mill, they were holes, a holes. OK, trust. They were corny, like corny guys. They are the most two corny guys ever. And I'm so happy Nikki dumped them both. OK, but I hope if there is problem in this relationship that it will be rectified. But let us know what y'all think down below in that comment section. Y'all do not forget to leave a like share if you care. Click that notification bell and see y'all next time. Thank you guys for sipping with us.